大家好，我是 Martin， and this is Short Stories brought to you by the Taichung Kada Language Center. Today's short story is called Deadly Beauty. Sorry, this is not a story about Black Widow from the Avengers, but it is about a deadly arthropod. The arthropod in question is called an orchid mantis, Hymenopus coronatus. It, this type of mantis is very common in Southeast Asia, and it eats other insects, preferably butterflies. I will tell you much more in the story, but before I do that, I am first going to give you vocabulary and some sentences. After I'm done with the story, I will give you four listening comprehension questions. Are you ready? Let's begin. Vocabulary. Deadly. Deadly. Some snakes are deadly, so make sure to avoid getting close enough for any to bite you. Hide. Hide. Billy tried to hide his secret from his mom, but it didn't work. Ha! Mom always finds out. Incredible. Incredible. The fact that Angel has been working here for over thirty years is incredible. Rare. Rare. This comic book is rare and worth lots of money. Mimic, mimic. The parrot mimicked the sound of a doorbell. Pray, pray. A hawk hovered over the prairie, searching for its prey. Approach. Approach. We had to slow down as we approached the traffic light. Among. Among. Michael felt out of place among all the girls in the dance class. Devour. Devour. The dog first sniffed at the food and then devoured everything in less than a minute. Be related to, be related to. Orchid mantises are related to the more common praying mantises. Now begins the story. In the jungles of Malaysia. A deadly hunter hides behind bright colors. In 1879, an Australian explorer returned home with an incredible story of a brightly co colored flowers that caught and ate butterflies in the jungles of Malaysia. This story of killer flowers had continued for many years before scientists discovered. That it was not a rare carnivorous plant at all. In fact, it was a beautiful species of insect, which they named the orchid mantis. Mimicking the shape and color of flowers, all orchid mantises are a mixture of white and bright pink, and their rounded legs look just like flower petals. Orchid mantises are related to the more common praying mantises. Both insects use sharp front legs to catch their prey and eat it alive. However, scientists were surprised that the butterflies would approach a predator this way, so they did some research. One of the first things they found is that the orchid mantis. Would hide among flowers that looked similar to it. In addition to this camouflage tactic, some of the mantises hunt against green vegetation so that they can be seen easily. Then there is the orchid mantis's color. To humans, they look pink and white, but some insects see more colors than we can. 
a butterfly sees a beautiful, delicious flower that it can't resist. Sadly for the butterfly, instead of getting a meal, that tasty looking flower snatches the poor insect out of the sky and devours it. Biologists are still studying the orchid mantis, and there's a lot left to learn. But one thing is for sure, the orchid mantis is as deadly as it is beautiful. Okay, story is done. Now let's do the questions. Number one, why did scientists decide to give the orchid mantis its name? A, because it looked like a flower. B, because it smells like a flower. C, because it eats flowers. D, because it lives in flowers. The answer is A, it looks like a flower. Question two, what colors are orchid mantises? A, red and gold. B, black and white. C, green and blue. D, pink and white. The answer is D, pink and white. Or, or at least most of them are pink and white. Question three. How do orchid mantises catch their prey? A. They spin webs. B. They jump in the air. C. They use their sharp front legs. D. They use poison. The answer is C. They use their sharp front legs. Have you ever seen a mantis before? They of course use their front legs to catch their prey. Question 4. Why does an orchid mantis sometimes hunt among green vegetation? A. So it can be seen more easily by butterflies. B. So it can hide from predators. C. So it can eat the green plants. D. So it can find a mate. Well, it didn't say anything about finding a mate, so not D. We know they do not eat plants, so it is not C. A bright pink mantis hiding in green plants, mm, I don't think that is a good way to hide from predators. So it's not B. The answer is of course A. So it can be seen more easily by butterflies. Well that's today's story. Thank you all for watching. I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.